Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Esmond, coming back to you with another video, man. And look, I just want to go ahead and tell y'all Merry Christmas. And also, welcome back to the channel. Because right now, we're going to talk about the Nickelodeon star Darius Love, who was arrested on Christmas Eve for domestic violence. Let's dive a little bit more into it. So if you didn't know, Darius Love who played Ray Alvarado in Nickelodeon's The Secret Life of Alex Mack, was arrested Christmas Eve, according to law enforcement sources. LAPD sources tell us police were called to the actor's Los Angeles home just before noon for a domestic disturbance. When cops arrived, Love's girlfriend told cops she was going to the house to pick up some stuff, and before leaving, she got into an argument with him. She claimed Love hit her in the back of the head. Sources say she was not injured and there were no visible marks. After the cops spoke with both of them, the 42-year-old Love was arrested and booked for misdemeanor domestic violence. Love played the best friend of Alex Mack on the show. He appeared in 77 episodes. He's also been on ER, Shameless, CSI, The Shield, and is always sunny in Philadelphia. After spending about 10 hours in custody, Love was released after posting $20,000 bond. All right, so basically this is a he say, she say kind of event. In other words, what I'm saying is the police in this scenario don't have enough proof to just say that, hey, he did something to her. Because even though just because she said it, there's really no visible injuries. There's not anything you can just really factually say like, hey, he did this. We're going to take him. So what they're going to do is they're going to take her word for now. And take that affidavit statement from her and say, hey, we're going to go ahead and take you in. Now, this will go to court. We're not saying you even did anything. We just don't want to be liable in the future. Just say, you know, they left and never took nobody. And then he wound up beating her ass or even worse, killing her. That's going to fall back on the police and they could get sued. So in other words, there's probably some kind, I don't know California law like that. But more than likely, there's some kind of statute or some kind of penal code or something to where they have that they are required. It's not it's not a what am I trying to say? It's not a um, option that the police may get in this scenario. It's more likely a requirement like you have to, as that officer, make that arrest and take him in, regardless if if you have the proof or not, because there's. There's probably more than likely plenty of cases to where that exact scenario I just explained earlier probably happened. So I'm not really surprised that he went to jail in this scenario. Um, I will say that for him, as far as the $20,000 bail, uh, I mean, that is quite a bit. More than likely, he just paid the whole thing. So he's going to get that back anyways. Um, I don't know, man. It, this is also going to look bad on his name as well. I don't know if he did it or didn't do it. But if he didn't do it, man, that's some shit. That really is. Because now that's going to stick with you. Because more than likely, I'll just say this. Most women, when they see that attached to your name, like if they get in the meet you, you're trying to date somebody else, bro, that's going to follow you. They're going to be very weary of like, okay, they're going to think, well, this girl probably didn't lie because she probably didn't lie on him because, you know, they're going to, it's going to feel so female power and I hate to say it like that and I got nothing against nobody no women no nothing but I really do believe that's how their brain is gonna think if you just think of it from like a survival standpoint so that's pretty much all I got man um y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comments below obviously this is gonna look really bad on his name and I hate to see it like this but we're going to see how this story unfolds. As y'all know, I will keep y'all updated. Make sure to hit that like button for your boy. And also hit that subscribe and bell for all notifications. And it's your boy, Esmond, signing out. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.